Hey everybody, it's Joey, and I'm here to do a Bath and Body Works Winter 2019, 2019, so stupid, 2018 um, uh, winter empties. I have a lot. I was going to do this in a week or so, but there was so much stuff piling up that I was like, I have to get it done now because it is just too much shit. It's just too much shit. It really is. It's like, I don't know how I'm even going to get through all this. Holy shit. Okay. First and foremost, I have a lot of Bath and Body Works stuff. I used up a couple of Jeffree Star products, surprisingly. And, um, I also used up a lot of makeup. So, I'm as well. So, um, let's just start off with body care like we always do. I'll do hand soaps first. So this is Bath and Body Works. So this is not, this is the only item that's not empty per se, but it's almost. And this is the one I'm currently using in Bath and right now. Um, it's all about the bottom, as you can see. So this should be done in a week, in like a week or so. Winter is a delicious, beautiful winter smell. I love it. Um, I think it's cute. I love the packaging. Smells great, and um, yeah, I love this one. This is not empty, but it's gonna, it's about to be empty in a week, so might as well, or in like two weeks. So just put that in there. This is part of the winter empties. Okay, now everything else is gonna be that you're gonna see is gonna be completely empty. Right, the next hand soap is, <coughs> I think it's dusty. I have like a paper towel just to wipe off. It's so dusty. Arctic berry. Um, Arctic Berry is delicious. I love how it's like the snow, but then it's like purple and pink in the background, like to, to signify that there's berry in it. Mmm. It smells so good. So I forgot my, um, winter candles in the bathroom, but I will be getting it. Like, I will walk and get them, and then I'll be right back. It's gonna be like towards the end of the video, so you don't have to worry about that now. But when I do get up, fast forward like 30 seconds, and then I'll come back and you'll see me with the candles. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm always forgetting the candles, but I'm not gonna do it this time, I promise you. It's in the bathroom. I just have no more room on this desk to put anything else on it. I mean, there's so much shit on this desk, I don't even want to tell you. Alright, so... Here it is. Very good. Love that smell. Okay, let me take that away. Ugh. I think so dusty. Alright, the next hand soap is a deep cleansing one. And this is from last year, I think. I think this was from last year. Mary Berry Kiss. And I really like this smell. I really like this one. Yeah, I really like this one. This smells really nice. I should have got multiples of this one. And you know what else? They should come out with this in body care. Because this smells really good. Yeah, I like that one a lot. That one's a good one. If, I mean, they didn't... Was it out this year, Mary Berry Kiss? I don't think it was. Yeah. So that was just a last year exclusive, I guess. It should have came back this year. I'm surprised it didn't. Okay. Next hand soap is... Um... Oh my god, there's so much shit! Alright, so everything's like uh, avalanching in the box. Winter Candy Apple. This is foaming. And everyone knows Winter Candy Apple. I think I did this in my last em Winter Empties too. I had this one in it. I always have it. Every winter I use up at least one hand soap in Winter, winter Candy Apple because it's a classic. It's a classic staple, you know? You have to, you just have to do it. No, that's not it. Mm-mm-mm. Ah, oh, what a classic. Love that one. I think that was in my bathroom for Christmas, like towards the end of December. Okay. Another hand oh, no, no, that was in the beginning of December. This was at the end of December for Christmas. Frosty Cranberry. And this is deep cleansing. Oh, no, this wasn't deep cleansing. This is Creamy Luxe Hand Soap. Excuse me. This is from last year, too. First, the cranberry came back this year, but this was last year's packaging. And this one just screams Christmas. I mean, this is the holiday season. When you smell this, you know it's the holiday season. That's it. This is the holiday season type of smell. Like, once you smell it, you're like, 
<laughs> there it is. There it is. We Christmas. We in Christmas. We in Christmas, bitch. We in Christmas. Okay. Any more hand soaps? Yes, there is one more hand soap. So this one is a full one, surprisingly. So this is pumpkin cranberry cider. Okay. This was, I guess I had this at the end of November. Mmm, this smells so good. Oh my god, I love this one. This one, for some weird reason, came back towards the the end of fall. So I had to pick it up, a, um, a backup, because I already used up mine last year. And they did not have this hand soap um, in the beginning of the fall time. They brought it back sporadically at the end of, towards the end of fall, so... I think that's the end with hand soaps. There was a lot of hand soaps. Now let's go on to body care. So the first thing I have is a two-in-one creamy luxe body wash and bubble bath. Pumpkin pecan waffles. This, oh my god, it took forever to use up. It says shower gel, but I, oh, body wash, but I only use it as bubble bath. And oh my god, I always, just every fall since, when did this come out? 2014. So 15, 16, 17, three years I had it. Three full seasons. I used this in my ba my bath during the fall time, and it made the bath smell like the fall. Mm. I seriously love this smell. They need to come out with this in in body care. This wasn't enough. They need the full line of body care for pumpkin pecan waffles. They do. That was the shit. And it's huge. Like, it took forever to use up. Oh, my God. Next thing, I have one more bubble bath. Uh, Twilight Woods. I had this one for a very long time, too. Very, very long time. Twilight Woods is no joke. Ooh. Mmm, it smells very good. Very strong, but it's really nice. Yeah. I like Twilight Woods, but I've never gotten, like, anything else in Twilight Woods but the shower gel. I think. And then, uh, not shower gel, bubble bath, excuse me, bubble bath. And then I think I did have a shower gel a year or so ago. I had like a shower gel years ago, maybe even. I had like a shower gel. But I never got a cream, a fried fragrance, but I didn't get the, I never got the whole like trio, the whole thing. It just wasn't my, it's not my favorite smell. And it's discontinued now. Okay, so going on to shower gels, the first shower gel I used up was snowflakes and cashmere. And this one, oh my god. I don't know how I did not find this one before. I mean, Winterberry Wonder is really great, but this this one was in the Winterberry Wonder line, and oh my god, this one is just as good. Mm. It doesn't smell like Cashmere Glow. It doesn't. It's very different to Cashmere Glow. I don't know what I would compare this to. It's such a different, like, unique smell that there's really no comparing it to anything. It just smells so good. It has cashmere cream, shimmering vanilla, frosted clementine, golden amber, and caramel woods. See, it's a very sweet, indulgent type of smell. You definitely smell the cashmere. You smell that caramel. Oh my god, you definitely smell vanilla. It's a very sweet, deep, sweet, um, luxurious type of smell. It's delicious. Love that one. Oh my god. The next shower gel I used up was Winterberry Wonder, and it is this right here. This has red winterberry, ruby apple, sparkling cranberry, snow kiss, camellia, and crystal vanilla. Oh, this went bad. I don't know why, sometimes the shower gels, I got to use them up like, you can't smell the product anymore because this is completely gone, so there's like nothing in it anyways. But it smells really good, I love it. I have it in the Five Fingers Mist, oh my god. Yeah, I love that. It's my favorite one out of that whole thing was that one, and then snowflakes and cashmere. Okay, the next shower gel, and I think it's the last shower gel. Yes, it is. It's Vanilla Bean Noel. And I always use up a Vanilla Bean Noel shower gel in the shower every holiday season. Mm, this one turned a little bad, too. Ugh. But it smells, I mean, it, it smells delicious. I mean, it really does. Only now there's, like, no product left in it, so you're not going to smell the product anymore. So, Yeah. You know what this one is. Oh my god. I love it. It's always a classic. Always a classic. Now I'm going to do body like um body creams and five fragrance mist. So I used up 
the Vanilla Bean Noel. I used it up in the cream and the fine fragrance mist. Yes, I did. I used them together and I used them up. Big accomplishment and a big sadness too because I'm not going to repurchase this. Not, not because I don't love it. I love it to pieces, but I'm not repurchasing it because I'm on a no-buy and I can't. I just simply can't. But I was sad to see it go because I'm going to miss it so much. It's one of my, it's my favorite Christmas holiday season smell out of all of them. Vanilla Bean Noel is my favorite. Oh, I love it. it. has fresh vanilla bean, warm caramel, sugar cookies with cream, and snow kiss mask. Oh my god. Yes, I used up the whole the whole trio. I used up the whole trio. Yeah. And this, I think, it was from 2015. So it took me a couple of years to use up the five fragrances Christmas again. I only use it during the holiday season. Mm. Oh my god, I love it so much. Oh, I'm gonna miss it so much. Oh. Ah. Oh. Love it. I love the I love the packaging that year too. Oh my god! Like I don't think we'll ever get a packaging like that again. So, because now the patch packaging has been sucking. So that's also I'm gonna miss. Like if I repurchased it, it wouldn't be in this beautiful packaging. All right. So next I'm going to do oh one more little cream. I used up a little body uh, body cream. Yes, mini miniature and um salted caramel apricots. This one was delicious. It was a mini. I used it up all fall and winter season. It smells delicious. It was so... Every time I put this on, like I took this out in class and I put on some, everyone was like, what the hell are you wearing? It smells so good. So, oh, and this was... This one, that one was good. Let me tell you, that one was really good. Okay, next I'm going to do the two wallflowers we used up. By the way, the, there's another wallflower I have, and it's... Um, in the, it's in the, my bathroom, it's hot cocoa and hot cocoa and cream. That, I did not, it's, it's all the way at the bottom, but it's not used up. But these are the two. This one was pumpkin apple. There was nothing to say, I don't know why I'm showing you that. And this one was Hmm. This one was for us to cranberry. Again, I don't know what I'm showing you. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh no, that was not for us to cranberry. Excuse me, that was tis the season, not for us to cranberry. That one was called tis the season. And this, this is the season. This is a little miniature, you know, pocket back. I used up one pocket back, I think, right? Yeah, and you do good on pocket backs this time around. So I used up one. And tis the season. And I love this smell, like, it smells so good. Like, this is also, like, Forced the Cranberry to the season are, like, holiday scents. Like, that's it. Once you smell them, you know it's the holiday season. Like, that's just it. It's the bomb. Now we're gonna get into makeup. I used up two... Oh, excuse moi. I used up three lip scrubs, I believe. Yeah, I used up three lip scrubs. Holy shit. That's a lot of lip scrubs. I don't know how I did it. I used up three lip scrubs in, wait, September, October, November, December, January, February, six months. So what, I used up a lip scrub. I used up one lip scrub for, t so it takes me two months to, to use up a lip scrub, a Jefferson lip scrub. That's good, because I, I exfoliate every single day. Like, I've heard people that had one jar of these for like a year or so, but I feel like you have to use them quick because they go bad, they have expiration dates. This was January 2019, so I had like another year, but like, I like to use them up because you never know when they expire, and it's like, I don't want to waste it, you know, so I want to use it up, and they're so delicious, they work so well, and they fully age lip, and I, I do use, I don't use a lot, but I use a generous amount, like I do, and then sometimes, not only do I use these to exfoliate my lips, I also, they taste so good that if I'm like a little hungry, like in the bathroom, I'll just take a little, I'll lick it, oh, it tastes so good. Anyway, so the ones I did use up, the first one I used up was Pumpkin Spice Latte. And this one, you guys, oh, so good. Mmm. O-M-G. Look, I used the whole thing. Oh, it's so good. This one sold out online. In fact, oh, no, one of them is not... Two of the ones that I'm going to show you are sold out on Jeffree Star's uh, cosmetics website. One is not. One you can still get. But this one sold out. 
Oh, so good. The next one I used up was Hot Cocoa and Peppermint. And this one you could still get online. This one I really, really liked. This one I really liked. Again, all used up. I think out of the three I used up, my favorite was Strawberry Gum, which is the, the last one I'm going to show you. And then Pumpkin Spice Latte, and then this one. But they, they're all three still so good. Like, this one's still so freaking good. Mm, gonna, I'm going to miss these smells and these tastes when they're... That's, I'm going to miss... I mean, I miss them. They're all gone now. And this one I just recently used up, like, two days ago. Strawberry Gum. Again, I exfoliate my lips every day, especially when... I'm about to apply on lipstick, I always exfoliate. I never apply on lipstick without exfoliating my lips. Never. And the only lip scrubs I do use are Jeffree Stars because they work the best. And this one smells so good. This is a classic strawberry gum sold out on the website, but it's, it's a classic. This one's a classic. Mmm, smells so good. Oh, shit. It smells better than some Bath and Body Works stuff, to be honest. It's so good. Okay. Next is makeup, and the first makeup product I used up is Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. Now this, this dried up. This dried up on me. I had it for a good five months, so it lasts a long time, and this is my favorite. This is the only mascara I use, I use, so. Yeah, I love it. Look, it's like all dried up. Ah. All dried up. Yeah. I'm surprised. Every other Too Faced product smells like something, even the concealer. But this only this is the only product I have from Too Faced. It does not smell like anything. I guess you can't really make mascara smell like anything, right? I mean, what would you make it smell like? Okay, the next product is this. And I just used this up today, no lie. And this is my the new one, the full one. This is the new one. But I just used this one up today. All Nighter Urban Decay Setting Spray. The only setting spray I go for just like Too Faced with the mascara by NSX. This is the only setting spray I use. So I live by it. I go to work. I come home from work, I go to class, and this makeup stays on all day and all night. It's like, I swear by it, it really is old. It's all day and all night, baby. Yeah, love this. Completely gone. Sometimes I would buy um, the the 30 mil ones, right? Because this is, this is, I don't know which one this is. This is, no, this is 118 mil. So the, the smaller one, and I would fill up the big one with it. But this just got used up. I was like, I gotta just throw out this bottle. I've had this bottle forever because I kept like re I kept reusing this bottle, putting the other ones in it and filling it up. So how to use that. And throw that out. So next is um I'll do this lip gloss. So I used up one lip gloss in Kylie Jenner. It's called Literally. This one I used the whole thing up. It's completely gone. And then I think the very bottom had like a little left, but I think that dried out. And then the brush turned, like, the brush, like, went nuts at the end. Like, it's, like, gone crazy, like, like, it got into a cat fight with some woman. Like, you know how, like, someone, they get into, like, two girls get into a cat fight and their hair is, like, all fucked up? Like, this is what it looks like. That's what that looks like. It's like that shit got into a fucking cat fight. Yeah, the hairs on the brush are wild, but listen... Yeah, you know what's so funny? Jeffree Star, like, just got, like, this wasn't like this forever. This just, this was only like this at the very end. And the, in the very, in the, throughout the whole experience, so the brushes, the bristles were very fine. They really were. They were really nice. They were like this. Like this, like this brush. They were like this in the beginning. You see how it's not, like, gone crazy like the other one? That's how it was in the beginning. But Jeffree Star, I think it was PR, I don't even know, got, like, the lip gloss in his PR or whatever, and the brushes came like this, like in his box, fresh out of the tube, came like this. And then he like threw it on, the, on Snapchat. It was like so hilarious. So yeah, there's that lip gloss and literally, and it smells like cupcakes, delicious. Okay, the next makeup item is the Brow Definer in Medium Brown. And I'm using this now, I'm always using it. This is my favorite, this is my go-to eyebrow stuff. I have a go-to item for each product. My favorite foundations from um, Makeup Forever, my favorite brows, Anastasia, my favorite mascara is Too Faced, my favorite setting spray is Urban Decay. Like, each brand has one thing that I love. Jeffree Star would say everything he he has is I love. Like, lipsticks, I only wear his lipsticks, really. To be honest with you. So yeah, there it is. Nothing to see here, just the brow. It's in every empty, you know what I mean? Okay, and the next thing I used, I used this, I had this for years. So these, this MAC Press Powder, 
lasts a long time. You can use it, you can use this for like years. Like I'm telling you, and I do makeup almost every day. So for that to last me for that long is crazy. So yeah, this is the Studio Mac Press Powder in Light Plus. That's my color in Light Plus. So yeah, that's that. That's the last makeup item. So now I'm going to go into the bathroom. Give me like maybe a minute. So fast forward this part a minute and I'll be back. You'll see me, okay? Just give me one minute and I'll be back with the candles. That was quicker than one minute, probably. Okay, so I used up two candles for this holiday season. I used up mint mocha bark, and this is um this is Bath and Body Works. No, it's uh, excuse me, White Bond, but it's connected to Bath and Body Works. So it's basically Bath and Body Works, and this is the three wick. <laughs> Woo! Kind of smells just to like like fire. Honestly, it doesn't even smell like this one anymore. So yeah, that's that one, mint. Mocha Bark. This one was really good. R smelled really, really nice. And then the last candle I used up was Frosted Cranberry. And this one... Mmm. See, with that one, just smelled like fire, but this one you can still smell the smell. Really, really good. Now, that's Frosted Cranberry. Another three wick. Used it all up. Now, what I do at the very end, like... When it gets to the very bottom, I'll just pull the wax out in the garbage. Um, so yeah. But it's only like a little bit. Like, I'll wait till it gets melted all the way at the bottom. And then I'll pour it out in the garbage. The, just the very little, the rest at the bottom. So yeah, those are the two candles I used up. Um, yeah, that's it. Those were my winter empties. I told you it was a long video. It was a long, long winter. I used up a lot of products. Um, I did good. I did good for myself. I, I think I used up a lot, a lot of products, and I'm very happy about myself. Very nice. So, I'm going to film another video tonight. I'm going to film how I feel about Jeffree Star now. I feel like Jeffree Star right now is the shit, but I didn't always think that. So, I will make that video right after this, and this will be uploaded, I think, first, like the winter empties. I don't know. This is the very end of February. I was going to do February favorites, but like, no, I'll do a March favorites instead and I'll do a winter uh winter empties this month. I love you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed and bye. Oh, one more thing, sorry I forgot. My lipstick is deceased by Jeffree Star Liquid Lipstick. Deceased. Love it. Um so yeah. I right, love you guys. Bye.